This is one of my favorite projects, painting snowmen on windows. We first start off with a piece of paper where we can sketch out our initial design. In this case, I'm just sketching out the basic image of a snowman, trying to keep everything fairly simple along with the baseline, what may be in the background uh, are trees. I am now placing the window over top of it and adding some alcohol and some blue and white paint. Try to let the alcohol dry a little bit before you actually start the paint on there. It will be fairly slick. You'll note that I um, take a little bit of blue and mix it along with the white and I'm working quite quickly with this to create this uh, illusion of that um, white fading into blue. Um, as I work I try to blend as quickly as possible and use fairly large strokes of paint and as I allow it to dry I go back in and scrape off some of the areas where the paint um, I've actually overlapped where it wasn't supposed to. In this case I want it to be clean because I want to be able to see this through the window. Um, I'm scraping out areas of where the mitten and the scarf's going to be and just smoothing out lines where I'm going to be painting. Now you can see that I'm adding the red highlights and black to my snowman. I'm also going to go ahead and add the green in the background with the trees and start adding a little bit of uh, light on my snowman's face and snow on the trees in the background. I am also going to work on the sky. In this case I'm using a mixture of purple, blue, and white and I'm working quite quickly with this because I want to make sure that my stuff doesn't dry too quickly to allow me to smooth and blend those colors together. Um, it's very hard to get a very solid sky in this case so we try to keep it fairly smooth. After letting it dry for a few minutes I do go back in and add a little bit of detail with some snowflakes and some basic dots of snow. In this case I am using a, a marker that is a paint marker. It makes things a little bit easier but you can use a small paintbrush to do this as well. For finishing touches this makes a big difference. Now. To show you what it looks like on the opposite side of the window, you can see my drawing there, but this is what it looks like on the side that is unpainted. A little different, but not too much. And here is my finished painting. 